believe that when I see it. Now pipe down while I finish my puzzle. Ah, raspberries. I'm gonna go make the rounds. Good riddance to you. You got any plans for the weekend? Yeah, gonna relax and watch me some television. Well, you bought a television? I sure did. Man, those things cost as much as a car. How the hell did you afford it? Mary's Uncle Lou passed away a few months back, left us some cash. And you bought yourself a television with it. That's what I did. You ought to see this thing. Seven inch black and white screen gets all three channels. Wow, sounds fascinating. What, you mean you ain't gonna get one? I'll stick with my newspaper and with my radio, thank you very much. This television's just a fad. We'll see about that, sonny boy. Yeah, so what does Mary think of it? Okay, this is the director's office. This is where the key should be. Alright, here's the key. Now I gotta get to the safe. This is the Empire Bay Police Department. We have you surrounded. Come out with your hands up. If you do not surrender immediately, we will open fire. I was having a good day, come on, you tough guy.
Well, nice to see you. Well, how'd you make out? Uh, things got out of hand. There was nothing I could do about it. We had an agreement, remember? You only get a third of the money if there's any shooting. Uh, let's see what we got here. Ah, shit. Something wrong? You bet your ass there's something wrong. These stamps you took have an expiration date. And that date is tomorrow. So, uh, what exactly does that mean? It means they're gonna be fucking worthless. But wait. If you can get them to the gas station attendance by midnight, they'll be able to stamp them and redeem them. You better bring them to every gas station in town. They gotta get there by midnight or we're screwed. If you don't sell them in time, you get nothing. Wait a minute, that wasn't our deal. You didn't say anything about any expiration dates. Well, shit happens, doesn't it? Look, you pull this off, I won't forget it, trust me. Now get going. The faster you unload them, the more money you get. Hey, uh, interested in buying some gas stamps? Sure. Just keep this between you and me, all right? No problem. Just make sure you do the same. Sure. Sounds good to me. Hey, uh, interested in buying some gas stamps? Sure. Just keep this between you and me, all right? No problem. Just make sure you do the same. Sure. Sounds good to me. Hey, uh, I got some extra gas stamps. You interested? Yeah, yeah, sure, I'm interested. All right, here you go. Fork over the dough. Sure, sure. Here's your money. Thanks, pal. Now forget your...
Some. Hey, uh, you in the market for some surplus gas stamps? Sure. Where'd you get them? Uh, on second thought, I don't even want to know. Smart man. All right, now fork over the dough. Yeah, all right. Just hope I don't get in trouble for this. Don't worry about it. Just keep your mouth shut. Pursuit of a hit and run driver. Copy that. Listen, I got these extra gas stamps. You want them? They're yours. Cheap. Yeah, all right. I'm good with that. All right. Right, here you go. And keep your mouth shut about this, all right? Sure thing, buddy. It'll be our secret. It better be.
Hey, uh, I got some extra gas stamps. Interested? Yeah, yeah, sure, I'm interested. All right, here you go. Fork over the dough. Sure, sure. Here's your money. Thanks, pal. Now forget you saw me. All right, that's the last of them. At least I got some cash. I should head back to Joe's. Jeez. Look at this. Didn't know Joe could even write. We got another job. Something really big. Stop by Freddy's tonight. Bring a piece and some lockpicks.
Hey, look who's here. Where the hell you been? Laying around in bed all day. Hey, I'm entitled to a little rest after that last job, don't you think? What can I get you, sir? Coffee. Just for now. But when Alberto hears about this, the shit is gonna hit the fan. Believe you me. So, uh, I heard you didn't score too big last night. It wasn't exactly my fault. Shit happens. Alright, come on, relax, fellas. It's a high-risk business. If you don't like it, you can always go break your back work at the peanuts down at the docks. Sorry, Henry, I was just breaking balls, you know. Uh, so how about tonight? We still on for what we oh, talked about much? yesterday? We'll in a minute. That is too fucking much, too fucking many! I want my money! What? You think I'm running some kind of fucking charity here? Do it! Now! Who was that? Somebody you don't need to know right now. All right, listen up. There's a guy who owes the boss some money. He borrowed it to open some big jewelry store. He's not paying it back fast enough. We're gonna collect his payment tonight. In jewels. Plus, uh, a little extra for our trouble. Joe, fill him in. The jewelry store's in the shopping mall in the middle of town. There's no guards at night. So all we gotta do is pick the lock and waltz right in. Sounds a little too simple. Because it is simple. Why's everything gotta be so fucking complicated yeah. with you? Says the guy who can barely change a light bulb. Look, don't worry, I thought of everything. I got these phone company uniforms so we can pretend to be fixing something. Fair enough. Let's go. All right, we're gonna rob this fuck blind. All we gotta do is wait until dark. Hey, so how'd it go with the port? What, you mean with Derek? Yeah, hey, he's a piece of work, ain't he? Give you a job? Yeah. I worked some guys over. It was small time crap. He shakes down these hard up dock workers just like he did my old man. Well, you didn't have to do it. It's not like he forced you to work for him, is it? My mother almost did. We're whining and keep in touch with Derek, trust me. He's got better jobs than shaking down wolf rats. Are you trying to hit every fucking car? What's up your ass today? What do you got, an aversion to red lights? Vito, open the store.
What the hell is this? Come on, boys. The cops will be here any minute. Move it! Brian fucking O'Neill? What the fuck is this? You crazy bastard, what the fuck are you doing? Barbaro, what the hell are you doing here, you fuck? <laughs> You're a little late, Chief. There's nothing left here fuck for you. Fuck off, Fatso. This is our heist. You want to get out of here in one piece, you'd better hand yeah, over yeah, everything yeah. you've well, got. Well, the sign outside didn't say Brian O'Neill's place. If it did, I wouldn't have robbed it. Instead, I would have set it on fire. 10 reported at the West Side Mall. Repeat, 1031. Burglary this in progress. This is car 54. We're on it. And I suggest you get lost before the cops show up. Ah, fuck! Kiss Let's my ass. Get the ass. fuck out of here. Ugh. Gotta get the fuck out of here. What the hell are you waiting for? Get him, lads! Brian, what about the cops? Ah, let's get out of here! I'm trying! Shit! When I open this door, keep those assholes off my back. Keep those a little more, just a little longer. Come on, you piece of shit, open up. Okay, got it. We're out of here. Vito, come on. Freeze, police. There's no way out. Another dead end. We gotta go this way, it's our only shot. Come on, Vito, move your ass! Fucking crazy, it's covered in ice. One slip and we're dead. We have no choice. I ain't going for the train. Come on! Get your ass over here. You waiting for a formal fucking invitation? Over there! Shoot! Jesus, be careful. Almost lost you there. Yeah. I think I just shit myself. Where'd they go? They must have gone this way, Sarge. Oh, fuck that. I don't get paid enough for this. This way. This should take us to the street. Shit! Cops! Freeze! Police! There's no way out! 